Hi, my name is Jackie Kai Ellis. I have been back and forth from Paris and Vancouver for about four years now. And I just bought a place, I guess it was in this past year, maybe six months ago. Uh, and now I have this apartment. So that's, that's the background. <laughs> As you can tell it's not completely done we're still in the very beginning stages of furnishing everything and my whole dream is essentially not to buy anything in uh, uh, to put into the space that I don't intrinsically love and feel passionate about and that's why it's feeling a little bit empty however uh, what I love about this bedroom is what's already here uh, the beautiful moldings on the ceiling as well as the working fireplace and the mirror above it um, really, when you have floors like this, I don't think you need that much more. Um, so the kitchen is now outside into uh, the larger space. And what I like about it is that now that it's painted all white and the uh, room is open concept, it's really perfect for entertaining as well. Um, so we did uh, all of this is new and um, obviously new appliances and everything. Uh, and. Yeah, I think one of my favorite parts about this living room are really like the original details. Um, obviously, I love my kitchen, but the reason why I bought this space was for all the housemaking details, like the corner moldings with roses that are kind of dangling down from the corners, and as well as the marble fireplaces and the old um, plate warmer in the corner where the old dining room used to be next to the couch. So this is actually where the bathroom used to be, and we changed it back into uh, a hallway, as well as used up some of the, uh, the extra space into making a bibliotech. So originally, this wasn't here, and this is where the shower was, and the basin of the shower actually flipped down, and now uh, we actually were able to create a really spacious, uh, beautiful, luxurious bathroom with a coffee tub that we bought as an antique as well. So this is what we call the rose room because everything is pink and in French, the rose is pink. So everything in here is uh, painted one color. We did custom mill work and this is actually the second bedroom that I created for all of my friends and family that are coming to visit. And uh, this is actually a little space that we created in case I ever want to put the bed up, I can actually lean it back into this space, pull the curtains together as well. Uh, but it's a perfect, quiet, little second bedroom that overlooks a courtyard, so it becomes a really uh, protected a little nest or haven for the guests to sleep in. The WC it has, it had a toilet in there, but what we decided, because in these old Parisian apartments there's not a whole lot of storage, we turned it into a coat closet as well as a pantry storage, and um, we used the same floor tiling detailing just to make it special. It's really practical. For the Paris Living team, it's so exciting to be able to show a before and after video of an apartment of one of our clients. When Jackie first saw this apartment, it was a hoarder's apartment. It was actually filled to the brim with different things and memorabilia and things from the past. And what Jackie has managed to do now is turn it into what she calls a nest, a very light and airy nest. We have to, of course, shout out our architect, Loretta, who helped bring this to fruition as well. And the whole process, I would say, took about a year for renovations. And of course, what we have now is just this beautiful, light, airy, sunny apartment. Enjoy.